Emil Lichtenfeld grew up in Budapest. His father, Samuel, was the chief detective at the police department, and Amy watched him train his policemen in martial arts techniques for law enforcement purposes. Amy was very athletic, and he participated in many sports events, such as swimming, gymnastics, wrestling, and boxing, and won several national competitions. In 1940, Amy managed to escape Europe after having fought many street fights against anti-Semitic mobs. He went to Israel, which was then called Palestine. In 1948, the state of Israel was established, and Imi was asked by the Israeli Defense Force to teach its new recruits sports and hand-to-hand -hand combat, which he named Krav Maga, Hebrew for contact combat. As part of his service, he was sent to foreign countries to teach the techniques he developed in the IDF, and back in Israel, he started training the next generation of instructors. When he finished his military service, he opened his first civilian Krav Maga training hall in Tel Aviv. In the early 1990s, the International Krav Maga Federation was founded by Imi and four of his high-ranking students, Gabi Noach, Avi Moyal, Eyal Yanilov, and Eli Benami. Its purpose was to spread the idea of Krav Maga throughout the globe so that mankind may walk in peace. People started to gain interest in his teachings, and he started instructing and developing new techniques that were adjusted to civilian everyday life. a warrior and gentleman.